on my way to pick a camera. to my channel so today I'm gonna show you guys something very exciting I bought a new camera so let me just show you which camera I bought or let me just tell you guys first which camera I have now so the camera that I'm filming with right now is the Sony a5100 you've seen it in a lot of videos of mine this is the only camera that I use to film all my YouTube videos so it's a really nice compact camera it's mirrorless and it just does the job really well uh, but what made me want to buy another camera or a new camera is that I didn't really like the images that I got out of this camera so I just wanted to upgrade a little bit and yeah so my new camera is this one it's the uh, Canon EOS M50 and I'm so 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 in love with this camera so the reason why I got this camera is because I saw Sumi and Alexandra Huang uh, on YouTube or was it on YouTube? No, on Snapchat they announced that they bought a new camera which was this one and I was like hmm I always like their images I always like their content so they must know what they're buying so I was looking into this camera after I saw that so here I am I saved up for it with my birthday money and I'm working now so I saved up a bit of money to get this one it's the Canon US M50 as I said already I got the body the black body with the standard lens uh, let me sh just tell you guys what's on the box right here what it says it says that it has 24.1 megapixels it's dual pixel AF <laughs> it has APS-C there's a 100% viewfinder, there's a very angle LCD and it is a Wi-Fi uh, and Bluetooth connected which is ideal for a vlogger if a camera has Wi-Fi because then you can immediately transfer your footage from your camera to your phone and I added everything on my phone so that's like heaven for me if I have that function or that Wi-Fi thing on my camera this is what the camera looks like it's the black one this is the body it has like a um, cap on here so this is what it looks like and then on the back it looks like this this is a view or this is the viewfinder this is the flip screen and then here you have your usual buttons and on top you can uh, put accessories so what it, what this camera had compared to what my current camera doesn't have is that it has this uh, mic plug-in I know a lot of cameras have this but like I said the Sony a5100 doesn't so that's already something that I really like next to that the flip screen is amazing so it flips sideways but it can twist all the way around like this can also go like this and you can like have it like midway it's really nice compared to my current Sony A5100 because that one flips up, up, down, up, down, that's all it can do. This one goes sideways and then twists all the way around, which is really nice. Also, this one has the HDMI plug-in, so I can uh, plug this with a screen and then I'll see what I'm filming on screen, which is also very nice. And uh, what this camera also has is a longer battery duration, I think, with filming because my current Sony will give up in a few minutes because it will be overheated and then I have to wait before I can uh, finish filming so I hope this one won't have that problem um, so now here I am telling you guys about my new camera but as you guys might know I'm not a professional I don't know a lot about cameras and if you really want to know in depth what this camera can do and like the options and everything I would just suggest you uh, go to any tech uh, YouTube tech page they uh, almost all of them have reviewed this camera because it's a budget camera but still has like this professional feel and yeah I'm just gonna show you guys the camera which I got and just show you really briefly yeah how it looks and which accessories I got for it so I'm not gonna go too in-depth which I will show you guys is a, a difference between this camera and this camera in um, uh, 
yeah, just in quality of image. So how it looks if I film on this one and how it would look if I film on this one. Also, I got some accessories that I'm gonna show you guys right now. So this is the standard lens which I got with it. It's a four, uh, 15, 45 millimeter image stabilizer Canon standard lens and yeah this is what I'm gonna use right now I am planning on buying another lens which I'm gonna buy next week which is the 11 22 millimeters it's a wide angle lens which I like more because yeah you just get more stuff in the image or in your videos which I like for vlogging and stuff so this is the standard camera lens which comes with the Canon EOS M50 then I also bought a new uh, SD card which is this one from SanDisk it's the 128GB SanDisk Extreme Pro which has a 95MB slash S which is like the speed of it and yeah this one is around 60 euros the camera is around 700 euro ish and it's quite an investment if you're gonna get a new camera but it's all for the better it's gonna upgrade my quality and what else I got is the video micro okay I was planning on buying a uh, mic but I wasn't sure which one but I did want the same uh, or the same brand so this is Rhodes or Rhodey so I was asking my friend hey which camera do you have and I am planning on buying a new one and I want to buy a mic this dead and then he was like oh I bought you a mic for your birthday so yeah you just have to pick it up and here I am a mic <laughs> So this is the video micro from Rodi. It's a really compact mic. It looks like this. This is the mic. It's really small, really nice to bring along, really easy to attach as well. Then there's this thing, or let me show you the image. This is how it would look like if you have it on your camera. So you can plug this part on top, like this. And you also have a dead cat to reduce the noise of wind, I think. And then just your plug-in cable. So yeah, I haven't filmed videos with a mic yet. Because the current Sony A51 doesn't have the mic plug-in. So I never thought of getting a mic because I can't plug it in anyway. But here I am upgrading my quality in mic or in sound and in images, I hope. So yeah. I guess that's all I have to show you guys right now. Oh yeah, the camera also comes with like your Canon strap of course and also with the battery charge and the battery. But I have it charging right now so I can start filming and show you guys what's the deal with these camera switches. And I think that's all I have to show for now before I start filming with the actual camera. So I got the camera going and I'm currently also recording with this camera and with this one I'm just gonna put them right next to each other just so you can see like the image difference So this is the Sony A5100 which in my, which in my opinion is very warm and yellowy And this is the Canon Let me just do a quick with the lens this is the standard lens from Sony which is a 0 0.25 millimeter uh, which is a 25 millimeters a 25 to 30 millimeters and this one is a 15 to 45 so right now I'm holding them almost at the same yeah what do you call it same distance from me and I see that the Canon is a bit more zoomed in than the Sony hmm Okay guys, so now I'm filming with my new camera, the Canon EOS M50 and what I'm gonna do now is do a little test in audio. So right now there's just the mic from the camera and uh, I'm gonna take another take with this camera, uh, with this mic and let you guys know how it sounds. So, oh, 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 oh. <laughs> this is what it sounds right now. All right now, right now, right now. Okay, I plugged in the mic. So I hope you notice a difference now. Hello.
Hello, hello. <laughs> I hope it's different. <laughs> yeah, so this is it for the test. So now you see the difference between the Sony and the Canon in image and also the difference with my current camera with a mic and without a mic. So that's it. I'm gonna wrap up this video now. I hope you guys like to see this and if you have any tips on how I can improve like unboxing videos or yeah kind of tech items showing videos then let me know down below in the comment section. Also what I really want to know is which camera are you using right now if you are if you are someone using a camera for like taking videos or pictures let me know down below in the comment section which let me know in the comment section which camera you're using right now because I'm always looking at different cameras and if I see a better one then I will probably hop on a different train. So yeah, let me know and also uh, not don't just mention the camera, also tell me why you're using it, you know, so I don't have to do all the research myself. And yeah, thank you for watching as always guys. I hope you like this video as I already said just now. And I hope to see you guys in my next video again. Bye. Do you hear me now? Do you hear me now? Is it any different than just now? I don't know.